Simon, uh, nil-nil draw here at York Road. I just said to Vaughan, it, it's a step back in the right direction. Absolutely. You know, uh, you come here and don't compete, you know, you're going to get beat. <clears throat> a lot of questions been asked about the group, uh, a lot of accusations thrown at the group, you know, and, and some maybe rightly so, but you can't fault their character today. That's certainly, that's certain for real. Um, We've had two days training, you know, it's not, not been a lot. A lot of stuff to do, big job to do, but we made a good start today, you know. I think you see out there a team that worked hard, a team that were committed, a team that played for the badge, uh, and a team that were together. And they had to be all of that today, otherwise it would have been a difficult afternoon. Um, I think anyone that questions a team, the last five minutes, you know, showing the last five minutes of the game, we was under big pressure. Uh, tired, under big pressure, defending the slope. You know, people putting their bodies on the line, blocks, and, and uh, I was really proud of them. Really proud of them today. But it's a long way to go. We know that, but it's certainly a step in the right direction. Yeah. We said in the build-up, we knew what we were going to get from Maidenhead this afternoon. <clears throat> and I thought the boys, as a unit, particularly the defence, stood up to that challenge exceptionally well. Yeah, listen, they got to. You have to come here, you've got to ask questions, um, you know, and, and to a man. You know, back four, yeah, uh, Femis in midfield was, was excellent, um, and Hoops worked tirelessly up front with, you know, not brilliant service, but, you know, he worked, he worked tirelessly to get a, a first part of the press right, and, and I just wish that a little goal at the end could have happened for him, because he'd, he'd worked his socks off with, with little reward, and that would have been brilliant for him. And, obviously for all of us, but, you know, <clears throat> good point for us. We step in the right direction, yes, you know, but small steps, we know we've got a big job to do. Just want to talk about young Eamon in goal. It wasn't really threatened this afternoon. There was obviously a lot of balls in the box, which everyone coped with, but when he was called into action the first time, big <clears throat> save. big save, you know, um, we, we just got, uh, we just slipped, switched off, got caught sleeping from a quick throw. And uh, I say when you your good goalies are ones that when they're needed to turn up, and he certainly turned up at that moment for us. So yeah, he was good today. Just been speaking to Vaughan. He certainly didn't think it was backs against the wall. We certainly had our moments in the game, and you'd think with a bit more confidence we'll have more of those. <clears throat> yeah, listen, I say we haven't done any really attacking patterns or movement. We we've we knew what we were going to be today, and we we don't. Um, we don't say sorry for that. We know what we have to be to come here and, and be successful. For us at the moment, a good point away to home, a clean sheet. I don't know the last time we got one of them. Um, is a is a real good starting point. And it's an, as I say, big job on, big job on. And it's it's like an onion. You take a layer off at a time, and, and uh, we got lots of layers to get through. But it's a great starting point, a clean sheet. I just want to mention young Femis Kefalas. Played a little bit further forward than yep. the defensive back line. What was the thinking in that? And But he put in a really good performance. Yeah, well, listen, what, you know, I watched uh, four games of Maidenhead. Uh, you know what they're about. You know, Blissett's an handful and they have good runners going in behind. So I, I didn't want my centre halves coming out there all to deal with him. So we put Femis in there. It was going to be a game of second balls and front screening. And he'd done all the horrible side of the game really, really well today. And, you know, I asked them how they felt at the end. And tired was, was the reply. And, you know, that's minimum requirement. I said to them, feel good though, doesn't it? You know, yep, they agree. They let them know, you crawl off this pitch. If you're going to play for me, you're going to play for Barnet Football Club going forward, you crawl off the pitch. And that's the minimum requirement from us. And if we can do that, we're going to add quality as we go along and we're going to get better. So it's a great starting point for us. Just lastly, the two new boys come straight into the team. For Beardy and uh, Skiverton had a, had a really good game. Yep, really pleased with both of them. You know, both give me everything that I, uh, I expected of them. You know, Sam steady, you know, good 1v1 defending, stop crosses, you know, marked well, um, and, and, and Skeffs in midfield, lots of energy, lots of legs, you know, well played better in possession, certainly. Um, but again, all the horrible side of the game, so to speak, he looked like he enjoyed doing it today. And, and that's a good, good quality to have in this football, in this league, certainly.